Haven't I seen you before? Not a bad change of scenery. Reese's place should be around here somewhere. Yeah. Look at that. Hey, quite the view, ain't it? That your ship came down, Dredger Gorge? Yeah, we had some, uh, technical problems. Probably met the Bedlam Raiders then. Attacked us as soon as we landed. Hmm. Glad you're okay. What y'all doing around these parts? Looking up an old friend. Grease Dritus? <laughs> Grease? Well, oh, shoot, I know him. I, I run the stables in town. Uh, my name's Mosey. Hey, Cal. This is BD1. <laughs> Why are you cute, little droid? <laughs> it's good to see a friendly face. Likewise. Well, path seems clear from here. Shouldn't get in any trouble. I should go looking for it. Oh, and, uh... Say hey to Domodendra when you get in town. She, uh, doesn't take kindly to strangers. We understand. Thanks for the advice, Mosey. Bet. Didn't expect to see you so soon. Thought I'd check out the stables. Well, these ain't it. I'm just tending Brutus here. He's an echo. Stables down yonder in town, and if you find a beast you want saddled, drop on by. I'll keep an eye on Mosey. Thanks. end up on Kobo. You can thank Grease for that. He brought him here on accident is what I heard at least. Raiders kill him in droves. I've seen him. Why would anyone kill a bogling? Exactly. You can't eat him. Can't skin him. Can't even trade with him. One of the Bedlam Raider chiefs used to shoot him for fun. Just point me in his direction. Don't bother. I handled it already. All right. Neckos are local to Kobo. And I've known Brutus here since I landed. Think they're friendly? Yeah. Me neither.
Another shard. Please.
It's all right. Look at this little guy. Imagine being scared of something so fluffy. circuit. is definitely different than the rest. Come on, you blasted beast! Move! You come from Dredger Gorge? You still walking, huh? The folks don't last long around here. Especially ones poking around Raider turf. Wasn't exactly the welcome party I was looking for. Sounds like you could use a drink. Monk will whip you up something nice down in Paloons. Thanks for the tip. <sighs> How did I end up on this blasted planet in the middle of this blasted outer rim nowhere?
I need to focus. Got a proposition for you. You interested in the opportunity of a lifetime? Maybe. Let's hear it. Some folks ventured into the mine just down yonder. No one's heard from them since. That's right, little droid. Could be the makings of a tragedy. Most things on Kobo are. Prospectors were looking for Priorite. Mine is chock full of the stuff. But saving those folks? That's the important thing, of course. I'll look into it. Now we're in business. Mine is just down yonder. You can't miss it. You tracked down those missing prospectors yet? Still working on it. Come on, we need answers. be a lesson to y'all. You come into my outpost, I'll hunt you down and kill you myself. <laughs> Seagrees again. Been a long time. Maybe he knows where the others ended up. Seer stuck in the past. Marin wandering. Ancient history. Fall behind.
This place could use some greenery. What if I could find someone to help? Try planting these seeds we found. friendly.
think you can pull a fast one on us? It was all just a misunderstanding! Hey! Let him go. That! We cannot do. This thing sold us a priceless relic. The key we have been searching for. Except, of course, it's fake! I thought it was the real deal, Ravis. Honest! Oh. I believe you. But mistakes like these cannot be tolerated. Let this be a reminder of what happens when you cross the Bedlam Raiders! Kill him. Remind our friend here why his kind are supposed to be dead. Surprise! I win some, you lose some. I don't think so. Jedi Knight, if you stay your hand, I shall withdraw in peace. Turgle. Turgle? Get over here. Yes. You're Doma? Well, yes, I am. You got a name, Jedi. I'm Cal. The Speedy One. <laughs> We'd uh, appreciate it if you kept this quiet. Hmm. Well, out here on the frontier, only way we survive is by sticking together. That's right. You didn't have to step in just now, but you did. Yes, you did. Turgle, hey. shut it. Hey. We'll keep your secret safe. Cal. I'm sure we could both benefit from it. Thanks. Oh, Cal, I can't tell you enough how grateful I am you saved me. Anytime. And those moves! Incredible! Where did you learn to do that? I thought we agreed not to talk about that. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. But do you think you could teach me a few tricks sometime? I really don't want you to hurt yourself. But Doma says that's what I'm best at. 
Hi, Cal. Remember to swing by my shop later. Will do. You monk, the Bedlam Raiders are gonna be the end of this town. We got no hope, zero, zilch, nothing. How you doing, BD? Ah, wait a minute. Cal, Cal, get, just get over here, you son of a bogling. Oh, 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 it's been a while. I missed you, kid. Let me look at you. You look terrible. Yeah, it's good to see you too, Grease. <laughs> hey, are you taking care of him? Are you taking care of the Manus? Oh, uh, we ran into some trouble on our last job. What sort of trouble? The Imperial kind. Oh, yeah, I should have guessed. They've been creeping around Kobo too lately. Jarrah's burnt out on the Mantis. We'll need your help to get moving again. Yeah, sure, whatever you need. Come on, grab some seat. Listen, Monk, get my friend something special to drink. Refreshments. One slippery Monk coming right up. Welcome to Pilude Saloon, the finest dive this side of Zeltrout. <laughs> yeah, your description uh, didn't do it justice. Here's sand in your eye. Monk and I picked it up from the previous owner to a, well, a, well... He caught a fatal case of blaster poisoning, courtesy of the Bedlam Raiders. We've been introduced. You okay, Grease? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> as long as I don't have anything they need. Hey, what happened to the Manus? <sighs> We are on Coruscant, gathering intel for Saw Guerrera. Things got bad. Only two of us made it out. Everything I'm doing feels pointless. The Empire's only growing stronger. Things, uh... haven't been the same since the team split up. Yeah, hey, we had some good times, didn't we, huh? Me, you, the Space Witch, Seer. Have you talked to her lately? Marin's always on the move, exploring new places, making new friends. I was talking about Seer. No. It's been a while. You? Well, her credits helped us get this place off the ground, but she hasn't visited yet. She's very busy with this new project. <sighs> hey, Cal. Why don't you relax a little before we fix the Manus? The galaxy can wait a couple hours. Well, we should probably get moving as soon as we finish up. I got a spare room down in the basement made up especially for you. You should check it out. All right. Thanks, Grease. So where's that room at again? The room? Oh, kid, you're gonna love it. Just take a right after the bar, through the kitchen, and down the stairs. You can't miss it. Right. Thanks again, Grease. Uh, yeah, yeah. You can thank me by getting some shut-eye. You really do look terrible. Get some rest. We'll talk more later. You've been working here for a while? A while. Though I'd hardly call it working. You see, that would imply we had regular customers. Shame. This place has potential. Yeah, that's the story I keep telling myself, Sport. That's the story. Why don't you head down to the basement? Check out your new digs. We can chat after you rest. Grease always had an eye for eccentric art. I wish I knew family was coming. This place is a mess. Oh, sure. But don't you find all the dents and dings give it a certain character? Ah, oh, we've seen a lot of each other's character over the years. <laughs> 
I doubt the kid needs any more from me. You two go that far back, eh? Too far, too long. Oh, boy, it's good to see him again. Ah, I better go buy a mop or something. Must not get a lot of business here. You don't look like a raider. What gave it away? No blaster in my face. No spilling drinks and shouting bloody murder. Oh, cute droid, too. That's BD-1. I'm Kel. About dang time we had some new faces in town. I'm Zig, by the way. Nice to meet you. Great to see you. Keep walking, slick. See yourself? This stage has seen better days. Well, what do you have to say for yourself? Is there a problem? I could have sworn I heard you stirring up a raider-sized problem just outside. I didn't start that fight. Well, it certainly seems you finished it. I'd love to chat, but I'd better finish my drink before the next fight breaks out. This got there. Let's wash up. You know, boss, I was starting to think that Cal Kestis of yours was just a <laughs> fabrication. Grease Trace doesn't make things up. Never. Not even once. Now, 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 no need to get your first fight. So how long have you two known each other? Me and Cal, uh, we go way back. Way back. He's not so bad once you get to know him. You think he's got the stuff if the Bedlam Raiders come back looking for more trouble? Are you kidding? All a kid does is fight. I can't be up to code, even out here on the frontier. There's the kitchen. Basement must be through here. Wow. Gray's really outdid himself. Kobo's pretty far from the nearest trade route. Looks like Grease makes do with salvage. My old scrapper outfit. Why did Grease keep this? I know. Creepy. That Sears Helix set. Wonder why it ended up here. He's always had a green thumb. You know he talks to his plants? <laughs> Let's check this out later. It really needs some rest.
Okay, let's go. Still talking in your sleep, huh? Guess some things never change. Weirdo. Hairball. <laughs> Thanks for letting me crash here. Of course. Why do you think I've kept your stuff around all these years? I was hoping you'd stop by and maybe take a break. We both know what happens when I stay in one place too long. You said there's a spare gyro around here somewhere? We've got plenty of time to fix the madness. You are what I want to talk about. I'm fine. Sooner we get moving, the better. And then what? You're gonna go find some trouble with Saw Guerrera? Maybe. Yeah. One of us has to keep fighting. That's funny. That's the exact same thing you said the day we all split up. Yeah, because I... All right, listen. I know you all had your reasons for leaving. But walking away isn't an option for me. I have to hold the line. And where's that gun, you cow? Look, I wish things were different, but you keep losing people. And you yourself said that the Empire is growing stronger every day. Now, maybe it's time for you to be something more than a lightsaber. Think about yourself. Settle down. Find a home. What? Home, Breeze. There is no home. Home was the order. It was my teacher. It was everyone I lost. What does their sacrifice mean if I go and I just give up and stick my head in the sand? I know you were dealt a bad hand, but you got to take it from me. Somebody who had to learn the hard way. You got to know when to walk away from a rigged game. Otherwise, you are going to end up losing something you could never replace. show you something. This is a smuggler's tunnel. It came with the cantina. Now you go ahead and look. I keep a lot of spare parts down there. I'm sure you'll be able to find whatever you need to get the manis up and running. Thanks. I appreciate all this. Kyle, can I tell you one thing? It's really good seeing you again. Yeah, you too. Breeze, I'll think about what you said. Hey, uh, watch your step down there. Be careful. <laughs> I definitely have a pest problem. Smuggling tunnels, huh? Grease always kept a few secrets up his sleeve. Stop 
for a long time now. Dusty and abandoned. More scraps, huh? Leave it to Grease to take another person's junk and add more junk. Sooner we get to Greece, the sooner we can. We should check this out. <laughs> 